multiple offer situations are back. People fighting over houses are back. Oh my God, the market must totally be back. Wrong. We are at that time of year, folks. This is what happens. Go read. Go on to anthonyspredictions.com. Grant, say hi. Hi. Anthonyspredictions.com. These are my real estate market predictions that I released right after Christmas. And I had said, you watch, we're going to get into February, uh, late January, February, March, and we're going to see a situation where there's going to be a lot of multiple offer situations. And many are going to be fooled into thinking we are right back to 2020 or 21 or early 22. And then I said, as we get further into spring and more buyers find homes and more sellers list, that will go away. And as we get into summer, many people will say, Oh, it's kind of like last summer. Now, some of that is somewhat rate dependent. Hey, hey, hey. Some of that is somewhat rate dependent. If rates stay up and push over seven, then you will see demand back off and you'll see less multiple offers. And you'll see multiple offers slow down sooner. If we see rates go back down, then we will see a situation where the demand will last longer into summer. But remember, we're at the time of year that there are less homes for sale and there is more buyer demand. So don't be surprised by this. And by the way, I just have to mention, if you do log on to anthonyspredictions.com, you will notice that I had said back the day after Christmas that I, even though all the experts were saying interest rates are on the road down, they're gonna keep going down, down, down. Go read what I said. I said they are likely going to go up again before they come back down. And I said, and in one year, they will be lower. What's happened in the last two weeks, two and a half weeks? Rates have gone up 0.75% in the last two and a half weeks. So all the naysayers that said I was wrong, well, I got a pretty good track record with the real estate market and with inventory and all that. With respect to rates, eh, I don't know what my track record is. It's probably over 75%, but it's looking like I was right on that one, folks. So log on to anthonyspredictions.com to check that out. Now, Massachusetts Realtors, follow marealestateupdates.com. I make it very clear on there and by looking at the graphs. In the winter, there's less inventory. In the spring, it goes up and so on. In New Hampshire, log on to nhrealestateupdates.com. Connecticut Realtor Friends, ctrealestateupdates.com. Florida Realtor Friends, flrealestateupdates.com. We put out monthly data there. folks. Very easy to predict what's going to happen in the market. You just have to follow the trends. All right, Grant, say bye. Bye. Because we're almost there. Look, folks. Jack, conditions are not good, buddy. We need snow. Grant, don't 